Kinders, welcome to another edition of Word Families in the Laundry Room. This week we're going to learn about the word family op. 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 O-P. Let's all make that sound together three times. Op. 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 All our words are going to end in that, those two sounds. So, let's start. I'm going to put a letter B in front of the first op. Let's do that. Ba, 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 op. Ba, op. Ba, ba. Next one. What letter is that? C, correct. Let's make the C sound. Add it together. Up again. Up one more time. Cop the hard C sound. Cop. Next one. What letter is that? H. Good. Let's make the H sound. Again. One more time. Let's add it with the up. Up again. Up. Hop. Mm. Letter makes that sound. Mm, M. Let's do it. M up. M up. Mop. Have you been mopping your floors at home? Let's help our parents out during this time. You can do it. All right. If you mop, maybe your parents will give you pop. P O P. Let's do it. P up. P up. Pop. And then we'll add the S. Change markers, it's hard to see. T -t -t. What sound is that? Good. T. Let's make it t up. Again, t up. Top. And then, now we're going to do four letter words. CH. Let's blend those two sounds together. CH together makes a ch. Let's do that again. Ch. One more time. Ch. Add it all four letters together. Ch. Up. All four sounds. Ch. Up. And then, I don't like this when my boys do this the next thing on the couch. Pull up, pull up, pull, put those two together, blend those two sounds together, P and L, pull up, plop. They like to plop down on the couch. And then I say to them after they plop down on the couch, let's do the ST sound together, st, again, st. One more time. St, st, up, stop, stop. Repeat after me. Bop, cop, hop, mop, pop, sop, top, chop, plop, and stop. Okay, we have some sentences. Can you read this first one? My frog can, what can your frog do? What would be the best option for that? Can a frog mop? No. Can a frog chop? I don't know. But most of all, they can hop. H-O-P. Let's re read this together. We always start a sentence with what? Good, capital letter. My, and there's a good space, frog can hop. And the punctuation mark there is a period. Good job. Read it with me again. My frog can hop. Here's the next sentence. It's starting with a capital letter. There's spaces and words, so we know it's a sentence. He is on bop? No. He is on stop? No. He is on top. Good. Let's do that. Spell it out together. T -t -t -o -p. Let's read together. He is on top. Period. Again. He is on top. Okay. Next 
last one. Here's that another sight word, just like, what's that sight word, H-E? He. He will not, I'll say it in my voice, to one of them. He will not stop. You got it. I think there's a period here, but I'm going to make that into an exclamation point to use some emphasis when we say it. He will not stop. And last one, my frog will go. Into the water. Sir, sir. My frog will go plop. With a period. One more time. My frog will go plop. Awesome. Let's read the four family sentences one more time together. My frog can hop. He is on top. He will not stop. I should do it. He will not stop. And last, my frog will go plop. Hey, why don't you get out a piece of paper and write your own up family sentences? I love you can share them with us too. Cheers. Don't stop believing.